Hello everyone, my name is Lanceo90 and welcome back to Major Minor. Took a bit of a break there because uh, my voice was starting to get rough after talking for so long. Don't normally talk this much on my videos because I've never really had something where I've had to read everything. <laughs> oh, so what do I think so far? Well, it's not bad. Um, stories kind of uh, been done a lot already. Like, uh, it just reminds me a lot of like Sakura Spirit. And, uh, what's that other one? Uh, Go 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 Nippon. The basic story of traveling to Japan has just been so overdone at this point. And we don't really understand the bigger plot yet fully, but I have a feeling it's going to be a little bit cliche as well. Um, but it's still not been as bad as I was expecting. I was expecting the grammar to be like really really bad and stuff, but it's been okay so. Not great. I still wish that... I heard the music is actually pretty good, but the fact that I can't find tune where it's at, I have to just play my own music here, which is unfortunate. So, well, let's get started again. Huh. It already got dark outside? Just how much time are we wasting in here? Oh, well. Akibara at night was a truly a specta spectacle to behold. Lit up like daytime. Did you enjoy your little date? I don't really call it a date. I was just joking, Rook. I do say one thing, that uh, it doesn't make it clear when my text boxes pop up if I'm saying something or if I'm thinking something. Like, if I'm saying something, it should be in quotation marks. If I'm thinking, it should be like in italics. No need to repeat it. Now I'm all embarrassed. Man. Because I was talking about me behind my back. That's new. So I made a joke about you possibly wanting to woo queer or something. I was, it was dumb. I apologize. It's only a little offensive. Were I interested, I would only swoop in and try to lose someone while they were crying. Regardless, it made me laugh, we bonded, etc. As you might not be aware, something came up. I don't want to interfere with whatever you two might have been doing, but I got a call, I have to rush you home. Oh, wait, what? Bonding with Rook? I know this killer is holding a bag of some sort, some sort of fast food. No way, they got food without me. Home being your hotel room place that you'll be living for the next little while. I'm not really at liberty to explain the specifics right now, but it concerns the safety of both of you. Yeah, it all seemed very important. We discussed it a little over dinner. Without me, damn, I'm hungry. I haven't eaten in like 12 hours. I mean, we're almost out of time to dilly alley. But the good news is that the hotel is within walking distance, so just follow me and you'll be safe in no time. Safe and luxurious. It's a little worrisome that both Killa and Rook are so calm under the circumstances. If this is a matter of our safety, it, it means our safety... Oh, well... That's a little bit of a bad grammar, huh? If this is a matter of safety, it means our safety is at risk. It's a bit repetitive. If we were to stay out here any longer, but perhaps Rook, is, Rook just worded it incorrectly. You did have a penchant for saying wrong things. It starts to lead us down the street. I hope that that isn't too much farther. Some rest would be nice. In fact, it wasn't that far at all, but it was definitely huge. Well, this is it. I hope you enjoy your stay. The room is 22B, and here are your keycards. Shouldn't be too hard to find. And just both our keycards. Wow, this place is massive. What kind of amenities does it have? Well, you each have your own beds, a hot tub, a bath, a shower, a masseuse. A personal masseuse? I'm not sure if I'm saying that, by the way. I'm saying that right, by the way. I could sure go for a massage right about now, that's cool. Who else is staying here? This is the hotel where contest winners stay. I wonder if there are any other celebrities here on vacation or something cool like that. Other celebrities? Look at that, I'm already getting full of myself. Hope you do enjoy it. I don't think it costs... I think it costs us around a million dollars to have you here the whole time. That's ridiculous. Thanks for leading us here, at least. Any hotel cost a million dollars? Like, not if it's like one of the regular rooms, maybe if it was the penthouse and it was a really, really long time, but a million seems pretty high. Do you have any further instructions? I'll be up at 9 a.m. sharp. Either myself or someone else will be coming to get you. So we will meet some more people behind Clay's life. Get to wander around backstage a bit and meet. Eat? Yes, finally. I hunger. That's all I wanted to hear. Gillis Eilery runs to the hotel room doors. I decided to give chase. I don't want to get lost. Doesn't take us that long to find our hotel room, but when we do, we are stunned. 
looks amazing on the inside. Dude, it's amazing here. It's everything you think in your head if someone said fancy Japanese hotel. Even has a kotasu. Not that it's cold or anything, but it's nice to know that we're equipped for it all. Just gonna get over how great this place is, top tier. Turn on the TV and see what's happening. I love weird Japanese game shows and stuff like that. Scurries over to the t table and grabs a TV remote. Looks like he's not sure what the buttons say. It must be in Japanese. But it's a big red button and presses that one. Sits down on the floor and motions for me to come sit beside him. I do just that. Wait, so... We're in a, a million dollar hotel room and we're sitting on the floor? I know, I know that's kind of a, like sitting on the floor is kind of a little bit common in Japan, but is it common for expensive places? I don't think so. Seems like there's big news reports going on about midnight deaths. Wait, another victim? News report appears on stream. He seems distraught, maybe even scared. Reporter, hi, sorry for this interruption in your previous program. I'll resume right after this brief news report. Um, it seems that another victim of the midnight dust has turned up in the streets. I, uh, sorry to give me a moment here. Seems like he's having a really hard time reporting on the base incident. Did he know the victim or something? I've never seen a, uh, a reporter act that way before. What's going on? It's a hard meter makes sense quite quickly, however. Sorry, I've been ordered to make this quick, but reports are coming in. We're just now receiving confirmation that, oh no, the latest victim in the midnight bus, it's... Recently in Japan for the baby of this world tour at the Pop Isle place. Yeah, da, da, da. What? That can't be. No, that's not true. That's impossible. The other silence takes the, overtakes the room. Perhaps a way of deep belief with it. But what happened to the tour? What happened to us? The place is family. They knew me. Uh, select everyone around him. This is it? So hesitant because of uh, like I'm shocked or anything because <laughs> I'm not pretty sure that was what was gonna happen there as soon as that news report started really but oh wait what did we play for like an hour I guess it'll be three one hour and however long this video is because I've only made two episodes so far I guess I should tap through this just in case. Hey Mac, recommend that you play through again. Alternate your cho choices and see how the story changes. There are some things that are attractive. Let Rook know he might be late to the train station. Rook the DNA NDA until the killer you're involved. Ended up going to the May Cafe. Did not make the most optimal choices on the train. Spent some alone time with Eclair. Rook and Killer got along at the end due to your choices. Not trigger any true ending flags as far as you can see there's lots to keep track of every choice has consequences I'll be realized we'll be able to continue the next chapter from any save point you've generated during chapter one will be delivered via an update to the game via steam one chapter will be released each month please speak out in the community hub feedback and input will be taken and considered the game is made by and for the community in the next build you will learn more of places fate along with the more about the denied deaths also explore the second world Terra. Be carefully before you make your next choices, going forward, the fate of two worlds is in the balance. Can you solve the mystery of the midnight dust? Can you unlock the true ending? Can you save both worlds? Or will they fall? Your relationship to those around you is the true key. Your bonds are the power that will save or destroy all. Featuring a large cast of characters, including Question question mark, Rocker, Rook, Righty. Claire, Jade, Daz. Daz is one I'm looking forward to because that's a woman right there. <laughs> In the Mian. Oh my god. Inumi, Caliber, Killa. Place, Conrad, Fidget, Peavy. 
Some of these male characters are so bad. flamboyant. Save, singe, shock. Let's, let's, please. What? The names are a bit ridiculous. Too. Trish, T Talia, Max, Max, Moss of the Cruelty. Please engage in the community hub. Follow the creator on Twitter at Clace or on Facebook under the page Clace. Okay, so now, now I've finished this first part, I feel I can be completely honest about how I feel about everything. Uh, that's too short. For a number of reasons. One is, I paid eight dollars for it. It's not a lot of money. And I know that the future chapters are coming, but I mean... If you look at a game like a Telltale Games game, you're still probably going to go over an hour in an episode, I would think, for each part of it. Don't know for sure off the top of my head, I can't remember how long those were. And that's a much higher budget game. This one's just it's just writing and images and only a little bit of coding to make sure like how a relationship works and stuff. So it doesn't really have an excuse to be short, and then the description for the game, it says it's like, a, I guess the full game, but after the length of many, many novels, is how it's described, so I think that this one would be like at least half a novel on its own. So, uh, yeah, it's pretty short for one episode, I mean, I, know, I realize it's episodic each month, we'll see how well we'll be able to be able to do that, maybe the game's already completely finished, or just leaking it one episode at a time, which isn't exactly the best thing to do either, let's see, um, while the art is good, it's not animated, there's other, uh, visual novel games on Steam that are animated, at least lightly animated, which I, I've used the term animation lightly in these cases, because basically it's changed between two pictures or something, but like even... Gogo Nippon and Sakura Spirit have way more animation than this. So that's a little bit disappointing. Um, the writing wasn't as bad as I, th I was expecting it to be. Uh, I was expecting a lot worse. It is very cliche, and I can guess what's going to happen. Like, Even though it negatively affected us, like that one reason, the whole reason I picked that one thing revealing the non-disclosure agreement thing with him is because I knew he was going to be the other dude, the other uh, winner. <laughs> and uh, at the end there with Playstein, I was also kind of expecting that. Of course, he's probably not dead at all, otherwise why his character would be in the game? Because he made it. Uh, as far as that ego thing about Place wasn't, like, really, really... Uh, major in the story. It did come up time to time. It was a little weird when it came up, but it wasn't as bad as some people have been saying in like the Steam forums. Uh, you know, it's his game. He can do what he wants, but... Uh, the sound. The music. I guess it's good, but I can can't listen to it because I can't adjust it beyond 0% and 20%, so I need, like, it's usually, like, 10% that makes it work for these recordings, otherwise I'm gonna have a really hard time talking over myself. Like, even this, even this might be a little bit too loud, I don't even know, until the episode's done. Um, the choices, there weren't very many, like, how many choices we make? Like, five? Like, it seems like maybe they changed a lot more content compared to some other visual novel games depending on what choices you make, because usually it just ends in the same way either way, but this one it looks like you might be able to go to a different location instead of the maid uh, place. But I don't know that for sure. I don't feel like playing through it again to change my choices. Um, I feel that a lot of the choices seem pretty arbitrary in how they affected things, like telling can't even think of his name. <laughs> but I've said it so many times, I can't even think of the Rook. Just t texting Rook that, uh, 
who I might not make it on time, like, make him so he, like, hates me almost, and it's gonna negatively affect the game. <laughs> Come on, I was just being honest, I don't know if I was gonna be on time or not. It didn't tell me what time, I couldn't even guess at what time I'd be there. And I didn't want to lie. And then the other choice I just made for fun, because I knew what the plot was going to be. But it also doesn't seem like a huge deal revealing a non-disclosure agreement to someone who's already in. That'd be like talking about beta gameplay of a game to someone else who's in beta with a non-disclosure agreement, which I don't think is illegal, actually, and he seems to be making a bigger deal about that than it should be. Um... Yeah, other than that, it's a visual novel game. Like, I would have liked some more choice options, but that would make it more like of an RPG more than a visual novel. But again, since the anim there's no animated pictures or anything, the visual part of the novel part kind of gets weakened, and since it was so short, it kind of weakens the novel part too. But it wasn't as bad as I was thinking. Hopefully the future ones will be more fun once I meet the girls that I actually want to be interested in. And that'll be quite a bit better, I think. But, uh... I also hope that they're not added as an afterthought. It seemed like the two that we had were relatively well written in. But I'm not sure if they were just added as an afterthought, though, because every character on the main screen here is male. And there's like twice as many males as there's the, the, the females. Which is sad, but that's all my thoughts for this video and this game so far. I'll play it the next time the uh, game gets updated. It should be next month according to what they're saying. We'll see. Uh, but till then, I hope you all enjoyed and have a good day.